Hello everyone, this is Will with Hodl Hodl Exchange and today I'm going to demonstrate how to begin using testnet bitcoins. We will go through how to get testnet bitcoins which are free and have no value. So they're great for experimenting and learning how to send and receive bitcoin. So to begin we need a wallet just like with real bitcoins and the wallet's purpose much like in the physical world is to hold and store money. So, Electrum is a great free wallet, Electrum wallet here. The Electrum.org website is their official site, so the download button at the top. Windows installer right here. And I'll go ahead and pause the video while this finishes downloading. All right, great. The next step is to click the installer and install. And this just takes a few seconds here. So when this completes, it will create a shortcut on our desktop here. There it is. Installation complete. Close. So now this is a shortcut link to the Electrum app, which is for real Bitcoins on the official Bitcoin network. So let's just double click this to verify that it works properly and, and opens, of course. And it does, so click cancel. The next step is we want to create a copy of this sh shortcut, actually. So copy, right-click copy, then right-click paste shortcut. So this is going to be for our testnet wallet. So right-click, go to properties, and then in the target here, go to the end of the text, and then press space dash dash testnet then apply okay and here's the text I typed in there and here's the website we're gonna go to to get the testnet bitcoins so first let's go ahead and just open our new testnet wallet and actually create it first so I double clicked Electrum, Auto Connect is good. Default wallet, let's name it Testnet 1 to be clear, our first Testnet wallet. Standard, we'll go, and go ahead and create a new seed. So here's our seed here, the 12 random words. This is a key to our wallet and money. It's the most important thing. So I will go ahead and just copy and paste it here for the purpose of this video. But as it says here, do not store it electronically. Don't type it on a website. Don't tell anyone your seed because this is all you need to access your money. You can download a wallet and enter in the seed to get access to the wallet's money. So this is the most important thing. If you lose your seed, you lose access to your money. So the next step, just click next. And here it's asking us to reproduce our seed to verify we have access to it or it won't let us continue because it's the most important thing is to have access to our seed and keep it safe and secure. Next, we create a password. Testnet one, testnet one. If we delete the one, it's weak, but when I add the one, it's medium. Of course, you want a strong password for your actual Bitcoin wallet. Address being generated. So here we are. And I would actually recommend go to Tools, Network, and then here it says Testnet to verify we're on the Testnet network of Bitcoin here. So there's our wallet. And the next step is to get the testnet Bitcoin. So we'll go to this website, testnet.coinfaucet.eu. Paste and go. And it's as simple as just entering in your receiving address. So on the, under the receive tab, we have our receiving address. Click here to copy it to the clipboard. Right click paste. Click I'm not a robot. And we can, let's, it's always good to verify that even though we're copying and pasting that we're copy, we want to verify we're copying and pasting the right receiving address and verifying that it actually copied this one to the clipboard. So the first three characters, N3I, the last three, W1K, 
N3I W1K. We're good. Click Get Bitcoins. And that's all it, all it takes there. So synchronizing, there we go. We've received. It defaults into milli Bitcoins, hence why it says 3,852. Let's go ahead and go to Tools, Preferences, Appearance, BTC. There we go. 3.85 received as indicated here on the website. So now let's go ahead and practice sending and receiving these testnet bitcoins from wallet to wallet. So let's go file new new wallet testnet 2 here for the name standard create. So here's the seed for our second testnet wallet. I'll place the seed here below in this notepad text document here. So of course it asks us to reproduce the seed to verify we have access to it. Right click, paste, next. Testnet2 for this password, just for demonstration purposes, only medium strength. Address being generated, excellent. So first wallets on top here let's go ahead and send money or testnet bitcoins to be precise from our first wallet to our second here's our receiving address let's go to send right click paste m f u y r v m f u y r v these match so next is the amount let's just do one bitcoin and click send we're asked for a password testnet one for this wallet there we go and you can go ahead and screen print this transaction confirmation number here if you would like but we can already see it's been received down here this little green button here indicates that the network is active and connected and your internet is connected and you're connected to the testnet bitcoin network here so that is all there is to it to get testnet bitcoins in your wallet, send and receive. And you can subscribe to our YouTube channel as well and follow us on Twitter at HODL HODL. And here is the testnet version of our exchange where you can begin trading testnet bitcoins. Thank you for watching and have a great day.